Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of um, 60 Seconds Reanimized. I'll remember the name this time. Um, so last time we made it to day 50, 55 or 56. I think we survived to day 56. So we're going to get back in. And this time will be Dolores. Dolores. Um, so we've read quite a bit of the things last time. And I realized last time it was a 59 minute episode. So if you guys did watch it all the way to 59 minutes, then... Thank you for staying around that long. I'll try to be a bit quicker this time. Mm. I need a quick drink of my tea. Wow, the sound is loud. We're gonna start in here, I think. Briefcase? Oh, it's a radio. Um, okay, 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 okay. Gas mask. Uh, that way, that way. Okay, grab soup. Love to see it. Alright, let's grab Timmy. Grab some water. Grab the axe. No. Nope. Okay, fine. Go to the kitchen, grab some food. Please. 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 Alright, she doesn't want to grab it. Alright, grab him. Terrible. Bug spray. Can I grab the bug spray? Let's go, go, go. Can I grab anything else? No, no, don't have time. Go. Okay. Sam was a little bit loud there. Apologize for that. I think that was terrible. I think that was terrible. I don't think we did good there at all. We got gas masks so we can send somebody out on expedition straight away. Um, we did get food. I couldn't grab the other food, which delayed us quite a lot. So, I oh don't know. Yeah, we're looking pretty empty. We got cards, gas mask, radio. I didn't grab a radio. We did get bug spray, so if we get that bug spray event, we can sort that out again. Um, so it looks like I got a lot of food. Why can't I? Okay, what's going on here? Okay, there we go. Right, obviously, everybody's okay. How much soup have I got? Doesn't it tell me? Seven cans. It's a decent amount. Last time we lasted 54 days with nine cans of soup, so that's pretty good. Water is just terrible. Um, we will send somebody on expedition as soon as possible. Let's have a look-see. Um, no one should be anything. Alright, out we go. It looks like the area is still radiated, that's fine. Um, the trash can is becoming full of empty soup cans and the unformidable bucket of o overflow. Both of them are attracting strangely glowing, suspicious big insect wildlife roaches. Weren't that big before the war, were they? Okay, this is terrible that we get this event so, so soon. We'll use the bug spray. I'm tempted to not use the bug spray, but we're going to use it anyway. Okay. Got rid of the cockroaches. Um, some people are thirsty. Who are we going to be sending out on the expedition? I'm thinking we send Timmy, so we'll give him some water and send Timmy out with a gas mask. Did I get the briefcase? I feel like I did get the briefcase and I've just clicked that straight away. I don't know if we have the briefcase. I don't think we did get the briefcase. Alright. Dehydrated already? Oh my goodness. Okay, everybody gets water today. I don't understand why everybody's dehydrated on day four, but we'll go with it. There isn't a lot of space down here, and we can smell everything. Um, when one of the wall bricks got loose, yes, do it. This is the uh, the rat thing, I think. The dead rat, we get a soup can. We don't need soup, though. We need water. Okay, we lost the, uh, we lost the radio. Okay, so the rodent was still alive this time, it wasn't dead. Fair enough. Anybody hungry? No one's hungry. Please don't be thirsty anytime soon, guys. Uh, knock on the door today, requesting some supplies. We can't do it because we don't have enough water. I, I'm afraid we cannot. I'm afraid we cannot, sir. You hate to see it.
Okay, we don't know if they were real boxes. No, we can't be like that. We just don't have the supplies to give them. Let's be nice now. Been a while since we showered. I got nothing we can use. We used the bug spray on the giant cockroaches, remember? I don't know what, how... Oh my god, everyone is sick. Wow, this is, this is a terrible run. Um, Alright, so every single person is sick. That's great. Oh my Jesus. Thirsty, hungry. Thirsty, hungry. Thirsty, hungry. You know what? Everybody gets to eat. Oh, this is bad. The last thing we expected here while sitting at the Fallout shelter was a trumpet. It was played by someone who was clearly not a trumpet player. And who had probably never heard of a trumpet player in his entire life. He came with a friend who knocked on the door and demanded that we let the merry men enter so they could take from the rich and give to the poor. Should we let them in? Ah, they're gonna take our soup. They're gonna take our soup and then we're gonna have no food and then I don't think they're gonna give us water. I think we don't let them in, but did they just barge their way in? Whoa. I think they're just gonna barge in. Okay, it looks like they did not. Timmy's back. Timmy's the only one that's not sick. Um, he came back with the gas mask. We've got two food and a rifle. No water. Um, we're not exactly sure what they wanted to come back. They sounded harmless enough, but can homeless people be trusted? Not when we have so much food. All right, we got a gun. All right, there's something fruitful on the uh, outside of the expedition. Um, is he fatigued? No, he's not. He's just tired. Sick, dehydrated, dehydrated, dehydrated. This is terrible. This is really bad. Are right, you get some food? We need water. We need to send someone out straight away. Uh, we got no radio, so we can't do that. And everyone's sick. Oh my goodness. I don't even think we're gonna make it to day 20. Um, we don't have a radio, so we can't do anything about it. Let's have a look what we got. Hungry, tired, thirsty, sick, sick, sick. Um, you get, no, nope, not everybody. You get some food, Timmy. I don't want to give you the last water. Um, he can't go out. Mary Jane, you gotta, you gotta save us. Mary Jane, you gotta get us water. We are desperate for water. We need just one bottle of water to survive here. Hopefully she comes back with a med kit as well. I'm sick. Sick. I dehydrated. He's got a drink. Uh, can he? Let's see if he survives one more day. Uh, we didn't expect to get a phone call so soon after the atomic bomb drop, yet there they are. We can clearly hear a phone ringing outside. Um, Timmy, you go outside. Please don't die. You're the only one that's not sick. Did he get us any water? No. Okay, Timmy needs water. Give him food. Thirsty, thirsty, hungry. You get some food. We don't have a radio. This is looking terrible. This looks really bad. We should have grabbed more water when we were doing the, uh, the run. Dehydrated. Dehydrated hungry. Let's give everybody food and just hope that there's some water in that. Now our patience is wearing thin, we thought it would be a good idea to take a quick look at the outside to see if there was any trouble in the area as we about to step out, a pair of animal eyes flashed at us in the darkness, uh, their owners started growling in a most terrifying way, we only had moments to decide what to do. I'm pretty sure that's the friendly dog, so I'm not going to do anything. I think. I could be wrong. Um, in other circumstances, we might risk battling a beast in the darkness, but for some reason, we felt that it was not to our liking, so we screamed and screamed with terror. The creatures was probably more afraid of us than we were of it. It left in a hurry. 
Okay, I feel like we're gonna lose this run immediately. They're dehydrated, there's nothing we can do. Um, just give them food, I don't know what else to do. Up to you, let us see if Hanham check strange noises in the pipes. Check how she has to yeah, talk to her, this would be good. She, so she's, she, she needs someone to talk to her. I think they're gonna be dead at the end. Wow. Hey guys, well, we get another run. Why, why, why is he made of metal? What the hell is that all about? She felt better, but she died. That was a short run. We're gonna do another run on the same stream. On the same uh, YouTube video, guys. Do a rerun. End adventure. Let's start again. That was terrible. That was really bad. So they lasted two days of dehydration. Not very long. New game. Where did we go wrong? I think we didn't get enough water. We're gonna go with Ted this time. She couldn't pick up the stuff anyway. That was the biggest problem, I think. We had an amazing first ever game and we've had a terrible second game. All right, let's have a look around. So there's Timmy. Um, soup, lots of soup in there. Um, let's have a look over here. All right, let's grab. That, that, gas mask, and let's grab the padlock, sling it, grab her, and is that soup? It is soup. Alright, okay, we need all of that. There's the med kit, let's grab the med kit, and let's grab all of this. I grab that, grab that, I oh, can't grab it, okay, okay, okay. Alright, let's grab the wife. There's the briefcase. Grab the soup. Oh, there's the scout's handbook. I could do with that. I grab the water. Handbook. Grab water. You grab the axe. Nope. Grab the axe. Grab the gun if we can. Oh, we did it. All right, we left Timmy. Timmy, I'm sorry. We couldn't save you. Couldn't save you, Timmy. Don't judge me on that. He was playing, he should have, he should have been running to the shelter. He was playing too much. All right, we got a decent amount of water, decent amount of soup. We got a lot of stuff there. Bug spray. I think I got the bug spray. Okay. Little short on, little shy on soup, but it's all right. Day two. Hoping this is going to be a better run than the last one. My goodness. All right, expedition. Thirsty, thirsty. Let's give a little bit of water to Mary Jane, because Mary Jane, you're going out. Out she goes. Dehydrated already. Uh, we can barely breathe in this damn shelter for the last couple of hours situation, so this is the ventilation one. So we'll use the bug spray this time. I don't know what the flashlight does, but we'll use the bug spray. Gets rid of the uh, insects. Alright. Nothing to say. Uh, one of the cupboards in the shelter has a bit of a shaky, so we pulled it to give it a home. Process of discovered a secret door. Where does it go? Where does it lead? Let's take the flashlight and have a look. Take the flashlight and have a look, see? No one got sick, so that's good. Every corner of the room and found nothing. Well, that's a waste of time. Better than doing nothing. Uh, no one's hungry, no one's thirsty, that's good. Um, as we were about to start our book club discussion on the only book we've all read, the phone book, we were interrupted by a rapid knocking on the door. We found out it was a group of refugees who survived the blast just like we did. 
They were doing much worse than and begged us to provide them with any water, food, or medical supplies we could spare. Hmm. Got four cans. Got four water. I'm gonna give them the med kit. I don't really know what else we could do. We could have gave them nothing. But, um... Um... Thirsty, hungry, thirsty, hungry. I'm not gonna give anybody anything yet. We can't sleep. We've been having problems sleeping, right? So they can't sleep. We don't have the med box, so nothing we can do then. They're just gonna be tired. What can we do? They're, they're very tired. Dehydrated hungry, dehydrated hungry. You get to drink today. Congratulations. Uh, we discussed everything we could. We don't have a radio, so there's no point even looking at that. Day nine? Sounds like they went to sleep. I hear snoring. Okay. He looks terrible. Um, there's nothing here. Maybe if we try really hard, we can hear the neighbors in their shelter. Rations. What we got? Hungry... Starvation. You get to eat today. Um, we woke up today feeling very uncomfortable. It was like like someone or something was watching us. We could have sworn and noticed movement in the shadows. If anything besides us in a life bunker, it's time to teach it who's boss around here. Um, take the axe. I don't want to use the gun. I'd rather we didn't use the axe or the gun. I think it might be um, the dog. I don't know. What do we get? Gas mask is returned. Whatever it was, it's dead now. Fair enough. Whoa! Wow, six water, four soup. And a radio I've never seen. And bug spray, I've never seen such a good raid. Wow. Mary Jane. You get to eat. You get to eat. Everyone gets to eat today. That's amazing. Um, the contamination in the town is still strong. I still think we sent somebody out. We could always do with more. A uh, group of doctors knocked on the door. Give them water. We've got supplies to spare. Hello? Um, uh, not yet. They will be, though. I'm back, guys. Probably felt like nothing, but yeah, I had to make a call. Alright, so, where were we? Hungry, thirsty. Hmm. I guess we're grateful anyway. Relatively clean water. What were they? Bloody fussy water drinkers? We didn't get anything for that? We just gave them water, we got nothing. Nice. Hungry, tired, thirsty. Tired, thirsty, hungry. Hungry, thirsty. I think we don't give anybody yet. Um, this is a good day to go outside, stretch a bit, get some fresh air, toxic air, maybe scavenge a thing or two. We're sure we could use some extra supplies. That's if we want to survive. Do we have everybody back though? Oh yeah, we do. Yeah, Timmy was, yeah, yeah, I remember. Who do we want to send out? I think we send out Ted, because it's the only one we can send out. And then, also we could do uh, with feeding Ted before he goes out and give him some water. All right. So, send Ted for the gas mask. And then, um, let's see where it goes. Alright, so. Got ample water, it looks like. I love that. Loads of water, loads of food, you love to see it. Um, what do we got? Hungry, dehydrated. Hungry, dehydrated. Okay, you get to eat and drink. You know what? You don't. Yeah, they get to eat. There's plenty of food. Yes, we will put the radio on. 
All right. Alright, that's just the ex-wife. Man, I thought we lost a load of soup cans there. Alright. The government is coming to save us, they think? I don't think so. Uh, hungry, tired. Hungry. I could have swore we fed them yesterday. Um, what's going outside? So let's put the radio on. We were able to get a weak signal, government, agency. We still have radio, it didn't break, so that's good. Hungry, hungry. They're not starving, so. Um, we thought we heard phone call. Um, let's send out Mary Jane, because if we lose an adult, then we lose the game, so. All right. I'm getting a little worried. About Ted, but maybe maybe I'm I'm too early to get worried. Hungry, thirsty, hungry, thirsty. We can go another day without food. Yesterday during charades, we learned that Mary Jane doesn't know how to spell. Okay, this time we're gonna we're gonna get some mother and daughter time. I don't really know why you would want to teach your daughter how to spell such a ridiculous word, but okay. I wouldn't be able to spell it. Dolores does not mess around. What started out as a spelling exercise has quickly found its way to a math revision followed by a short physics course and ending in tinkering with random objects in the shelter. Mary Jane looks exhausted, but we can't deny the state of our shelter has improved today. Okay. Really? What improved in the shelter, can I ask? Dehydration hungry, dehydration hungry. Okay, so you both get your drink today. Um... Yeah, I think that's going to be it. Uh, wouldn't you know it, our dear Mary Jane keeps a diary. For some reason, she was hiding it in the scout book we keep in a shelter. We have no doubts what needs to be done right now. Each of us must be assigned a role, and the diary must be read aloud, right? No. We are not going to read someone's private diary out. Ted's back, let's go. What did you get for us, Ted? Uh, Mary Jane is happy that we didn't read it. I thought she would be. We got two soup. The whole neighborhood was reduced to nothing more than radioactive ashes covered by debris. There isn't much left. We used the barbecue hose. All right, did we get more? Oh, we got checkerboard. We got two water. This is great. Um, this is great. Well done. Well done, Ted. I think we just, I don't know. I think we just relax now. Make contact with the other wastelanders. We haven't made any contact with the twins, and we haven't made contact with the military, so... I still think we need to go out on expeditions, but for the moment, I'm happy with this. How can I not be happy? I think everybody gets to eat today. Hungry. You know what? Everybody gets to eat. Um... It seems fairly quiet. Maybe it's safe. Maybe it's not. We won't know until we go out. We'll go out and we still have the gas mask, so we will wear it. I don't think we need to wear it, but we'll wear it anyway. I'd rather that than someone gets sick. Um, our supplies are scarce. Our morale is low. You can almost smell the desperation in the shelter. We're pretty sure there's a small group of survivors nearby, mostly old folks from the retirement home. It shouldn't be hard to borrow some of their supplies. They're old anyway, and we need them more than them, right? No. We're not going to steal from the old people's home because we have loads of supplies. How can you want to steal when we have that much? What is wrong with you? Alright, we're not bandits, exactly. We're not bandits. That's it. Um, hungry, tired, thirsty. Hungry. Hungry, tired. I could have swore we just fed everybody yesterday. And yet everybody is still hungry. Um... 
Well, Ted, I'm gonna send you out, so I'm gonna give you... Oh, no, we're not. We're not gonna send Ted out. Okay, you can starve a little bit. We're gonna send Dolores out. Why not? Uh, oh. And take the gas mask just in case. And I hope she comes back. If not, there's gonna be just two of us around. We need people to go out anyway, so they can... Even if they see the tank or something like that, it is good. It is all good. Alright, let's have a look. He should be starving. He's not. He's just dehydrated. She's thirsty and hungry. We have enough water, but I'm gonna control the rations like we don't have. Uh, we've been smelling something funny in the shelter ever since we woke up. Sure enough, there was something or someone started a fire and it's already spreading. We can't save everything. What do we save from the flames? That's a shame. Um, I think I think we saved the radio. Although the radio will break and the scout's handbook is very valuable. You can use it over and over and over again, it doesn't break, but yeah, you can see where there was a fire. You can see it. Fair enough. Oh do we kept the scout's handbook? We didn't lose it? We were able to put out the fire and nothing seems to be damaged, at least not very bad. Wow! Fair enough. Hungry. Hungry, tired, dehydrated. You get water. Um, we decided to peek outside for just a minute to see in the store around the corner was still standing. Uh, we were out about to step out. We heard a growl in darkness. We'll use the flashlight. I think this is the dog. Radio activity. I mean, uh, radio. Sorry. Yeah, it is radio. Um, uh, I guess what? It was a dog. The poor thing seemed tired, so we let it stay with us for the night. The next morning, we opened the door to let it out. It still hasn't returned. Hopefully, it will come back later. Very good. I thought it was the dog. Hungry, fatigued. Um, hmm. Fatigued. I think it's fine. Um, received another transmission from the army. The, they'll be doing a quick sweep of the area and ask all survivors to leave markings on the nearest bus stop. That's a shame we don't have cards. That's a shame. Um, yep, we missed it. What can we do? Nothing we can do. Uh, thirsty starvation, you get to eat. Yeah, you're not gonna eat. Uh, Mr. Easy Duncan Trader carrying an equally scruffy bag on his shoulder paid us a visit. He offered a simple one time deal for just one. No, we're not doing it. I don't trust it. That's great. So Dolores is dead. That is not good. We need to send someone out on expedition. Uh, something or someone is below us. Let's get the flashlight. Maybe we take the axe. Mm, take the flashlight. We won't be able to see what's down there, so I think the flashlight is more sensible. Hopefully, he doesn't get sick. He didn't get sick. We got a med box. When did we get that? Oh, just now. Perfect. Um, all right. I think we're in a really good place here. We can last quite a long time. Starvation and dehydration, that's not good. You know what? You all get to eat today because we've lost, you lost your mom. Um, she's starving, so we, ah, uh, we can't send him out. And she's starving. But we did give her food and water, so maybe she'll be okay. We don't have the gas mask anymore. Um, I don't think it's, there's radiation out there anymore, so... I'm gonna give her the map and see if the map helps. I'm curious. Good luck, Mary Jane. All right, Ted, it's just you. You know what you can eat. It keeps you sane. Um, 
All right, today we have a visitor, so we've got, they offer cards for the med box. They offer the harmonica for the lock. Can we take both deals? I'll take them both. I don't think we need the med kit. And the uh, harmonica is more valuable than the lock. Because it defends us three raids instead of just one. Interesting, so we got a med kit back somehow. Minus one lock for the harmonica. Interesting, so the other deal didn't happen then. Fatigued. Um, barking at our doorstep. Alright, so it's the dog. We're going to give him the uh, soup can. I think that also increases his sanity, so he's not going to be going insane, which is good. He's not sick, he's not going insane. And we're looking good. Uh, the dog is back in form itself under an hour. We don't know what they put in that soup, but man, that stuff is good. We decided the dog needed a name, and the right name for him is Pancake. Come here, Pancake. Who's a good boy? Pancake stayed around for a while, but was gone next morning. We can bet he will be back. Let's hope so. Firstly, you get to drink, because there's only you in the house. Um, a note found on the door today was a real surprise to all of us. Um, it's not signed, but it says that whoever wrote it has been observing us for a while and believes we're the right kind of people. They instruct us to single warm representative meeting today at midnight to find out more. Should we send someone? Yeah, I, I guess. I'm hoping that that's not game over. It's not. Okay. Okay, so it's the twins event. Okay. I guess we have to just wait for further information on that. Um, you know what? We're getting a little low on food, so I'm not gonna feed you. He wants to be our friend, at least that's what he says. He looks harmless, although he seems to have acquired an extra pair of arms. Uh, last time I didn't do this event. We'll fight off the next raiding party. I think we give him water. We've got plenty of water. I just hope he doesn't get sick. But we do have a med kit, so I'm curious to see if he gets sick or not. He did not get sick. We don't need the raid defense, but it's better than nothing. Fatigued, hungry. We're not going to feed you. Time to listen to the radio. Let's listen to it. Getting a little nervous now because um, Mary Jane has been gone, I think it's five days now. And she had a map. Nothing on the radio. Hungry, thirsty. You can drink today, but you're not going to eat. Um, we could use some extra supplies. The last time we went in the supplier run, we noticed a damaged tank stuck in the rubble nearby. How about we send someone to investigate? I'd rather not. I'd rather not. I think we're good. Mary Jane's back. Let's go. Hey, the map looks looks a bit destroyed and for all we know it might be a trap exactly you okay Ara? good morning okay we got two soup two water You're yes Ted's stomach is rumbling Ted is no longer thirsty it. yeah it's first time we're playing it but you have to be quiet because we're streaming uh, hungry hungry tired Hungry, hungry. Hmm. I'm not gonna feed anyone today. Uh, it's not the best, but we could take the risk. State of the wasteland remains unknown to us. Maybe we should risk it and go out. After all, you only live once. I think we don't. Not this time. Um, did we lose the cards? Oh yeah, we didn't get the cards. See, if we got the cards, we would've been all right. We did not get the cards. Come in, Angelina, close the door. Did you have a good sleep? Uh, don't we miss our chance? Yep. We're of that. Uh, time to... Alright, so... Tired, fatigue, thirsty, starvation. Alright, you need to eat. She needs to eat. And I think she drinks water. Um, Ted is happy to take the risk his life in the wastes. It seems awfully quiet outside. Maybe it's safe. Maybe it's not. We don't know until we go out. Oh, you know what? We'll go. Um, you would expect the post-apocalypse to be quite time of peace and quiet since you know most of the people aren't around anymore. Yet, here we have someone at the door. 
When we opened it, we encountered a strange looking man in a blue jumpsuit who asked us to trade him a water chip. A water chip? What in the hell? Nah, let's give him water. We've got a med kit if we need it. Alright, no one's dead. We got a gas mask. Yo! Yeah? Yeah, that's good. No one's dead yet. Tired, fatigued, hungry. Thirsty, hungry. Those two are dead, yeah. Alright, we're gonna take a risk here and send Ted. Uh, what should we give Ted? Let's give him... Let's give him the gun. Yeah, let's give him the gun. We've got enough raid protection. Yeah, we should be fine. We've got the harmonica. Alright. Alright, let's have a look. Tired, fatigue, hungry, you get to eat. Because we got loads. Um, <coughs> Alright, they offer a padlock for the flashlight. No, they offer cards for the med box. I think we've got to do this one because we need the military. And I'm guessing we don't get another map. So, we got the pack of cards. And hungry, thirsty, you get to drink today. And you get to eat. Hanke came back today very agitated about something. He really wanted us to get out and follow him somewhere in the neighborhood. This seems a bit risky, but maybe Pancake's on the trail of something big. What gear should you take? Take an axe. I really wish I took the gun now. Alright, she's alive. Oh wow, we got full water. Uh, Forced to be reckoned with. Those two thugs were... Okay, so we chased off some bandits with an axe and got four bottles of water. That's perfect. Um, during our latest expedition, we ran into a smelly man in torn up clothes. We recognized him as an old bum named Jim who used to run the streets of our town before the bomb fell. Now he roams the wasteland and it looks like he followed us home. Now he's banging on our door asking if we want to buy a rock. Well, do we? No. We do not. He's probably someone crazy. And we don't have a med box, so I don't want to risk it. Um, yeah. That's right. We didn't do it. Fatigued? Right. Okay, I'm getting worried. I feel like we're gonna lose because Ted hasn't come back. Their word and visited us again with a request. Seeing they're slowly running out of space in the tent, their group is attempting to build a small camp for themselves. They already gathered some resources, but they need someone to help with the chop wood and build houses. Okie dokie. What if we get raided while they're gone? I don't like this. Alright, she's back. She's gotta be exhausted. Yeah, it took a few hours, but we managed to chop everything and they asked us to do an even a bit more. Everybody was really grateful. Alright, so, thirsty, you get to drink. Okay, what do we got here? Um, water for any one of these. Do we need water? I don't think we need water at all. We're okay. Um, so no, I'm not gonna give anything. Um, no, nothing. This is a great run so far. Although we have lost two people. I'm really worried about Ted though. Ted has to come back. We really need Ted to come back. Hungry, eat some food. And um, we could really use some more supplies. We, we counted all of them today and the numbers did not make happy. Time to do something about it. We know that there's a teacher from the local school managed to rescue a bunch of kids and lead them to the nearby building where they're relatively safe and we could really use whatever they have. We could really use it, right? No, we're not that kind of people. Ted, Ted is home, let's go. He's home. What did he get us? Um, he brought the gun back. Uh, robbing innocent people? Absolutely not. Exactly. Uh, aimlessly among the ruins. It's not usual where we're drawn places loved, even though we weren't specifically looking for it. We've got three soup and two water. Oh my goodness. 
We believe that in our expedition the wasteland must have been followed by strangers. We should be more cautious next time. We spotted some sort of vehicle just down the street, but couldn't get good enough look at it in the dark. Maybe we can expedition improve. Okay. What's up? Um, yeah, 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 just um, put that on the floor, you can use that chair. Just be careful, careful with it though, yeah? You got it? Or do you need me to do it? Let me do it, let me do it. Right, we're not gonna send anybody out. Um, no, we're not sending anybody on an expedition. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I only hope is to patch him up and hope for the best. Grab a med kit. We don't have a med kit. Ah, oh, pancake's dead. Wait, I know a med kit. Pancake the dog. I hope he's all right. I think he's dead though. Uh, still a nuclear bomb dropping on our heads. We were wrong. We buried Pancake. Oh, Pancake's dead! No. Mary Jane has been asking about it all day. Okay, so people are thirsty and hungry. Tired, thirsty, hungry. You get to eat and drink. Thirsty, you get to drink. We got loads of supplies. Um, we're not certain about the situation on the surface. Trip could be risky, but we could really do with supplies. No, we don't need them. We're good. Um, okay, the army. We have the cards. Let's put them out. We might get rescued. Where's Harry? Okay, let's have a look. Uh, the cards are placed on the door, so that's an achievement done. Hungry, you get to eat. Fatigued, that's fine. Move on. Um, we're not going to send anybody out. Uh, Sleezing and Trader carrying equally a scruffy bag. No, nope, we're not going to do it. Uh, wait for the instructions from. Wait for instructions. All right, we just have to await more instructions on the military. Um, we're not gonna give him anything. It's a sleazy-looking man. I don't trust him. I think we're good. I think this is gonna be a win. Ted is no longer hungry. Jane is no longer hungry. Um, I thought she said she wasn't hungry. Mary Jane is restless and lonely. She really misses her music lessons and she would love to visit her high school again. It's a little further than Timmy's school, but it could be worth the trip. There could still be some supplies there or maybe she runs into some other kids. It's risky, of course, but it might not be the worst idea ever. So how about it? Should she go for a walk? I think no. Did you find this kid? I think no. Yeah, I did. Okay. Mm -hmm. Don't ever tell your teenage kids, no, Mary Jane, you will not go to school today, and that's the end of it, young lady. Yeah. Yeah, we will. All right, let's be quiet, girls, because I need to finish this video, okay? And then we're going to eat some breakfast. Um, we are not going to send anybody out. Um... There we were thinking it's day like no other down here, confronted us. She said it's her birthday, but she doesn't want a gift. Not this situation, not in this economy. Well, she's too young to be giving orders around here. So she's getting a birthday present and that's that. We just need to pick out something. Give her the cards. <laughs> Give her a pack of cards. Mary Jane loved the cards. Very nice. Glad she's happy. Fatigued, fatigued. I think we're gonna get bandits coming to the door soon. Uh, the problem is simple. If we don't wash ourselves, we'll get sick. Hmm. Yeah, 100 days alive. I know, I saw. Okay. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger. If we can survive just a little bit longer, dirty ears shouldn't be much of a problem. Just be shh. Just be shh. All right, let's have a look. Hungry, fatigued, fatigued. You get to eat. We are not going to go outside. And the trash can is becoming blah blah blah. We'll use the bug spray. Use the bug spray. Spray the bin. 
Day 47. Ten more days and we've beaten our last record. Take thirsty. Thirsty. Was that? Yeah, just thirsty. Nope. We're staying home. Siblings visited us again and reveal the camp is almost finished. People are starting to move in and among them. Uh, kids. The group strongly believes that these children need to get educated. We will give them the book. I think we give them the book, so we don't have the book. Day 48. We need the twins to save us or the military. Either way, we're good. Um, we gifted our beloved handbook. Um, she would find a way after finishing school to get some sort of wasteland. Makes perfect sense. How we looking? Fatigued? Hungry? You get to eat. We're not going out. Uh, one minute it was all fine, and the next we were at each other's throats. How did this happen? This is insane. We need to get a grip of ourselves. If we are going to survive this, let's just sleep on it. Well, I don't blame them. They're stuck in a bunker for 49 days. That's... I couldn't do it. Um, enough arguing. They are more important things to worry about. Yeah, I've given you food and water. I mean, what, what more do you want? Right, no one's going out. Uh, the bottom sounds of Volume Warming, mean, too bad we don't have a TV to optimize. Yeah, you can do some roleplay with the um, the axe, as long as you don't hit each other with it. Day 50. Hey, we still have the axe, that's good. Uh, I didn't really use the big cinema bus before the apocalypse, so they instantly jumped on this idea. Mary Jane always complained of singing in the rain, lacks of action, so they took the axe and improvised an extra scene. Very bloody. They insist the movie would have been way better if it had more axes in it. Nice. Good for you guys. Thirsty? It's a drink. Thirsty? Drink some water. No one's going out. Mary Jane didn't utter a single word today. This is very odd. Maybe someone should find out what is going on with her. There's only you in the room, buddy. I think they do need fresh air. And uh, nothing solves problems better than an honest conversation. So uh, I think she's better now. Hungry, fatigued, eat some food. We got loads of stuff left, so why not? Uh, the military is communicating through radio. Good stuff. Let's give the uh, let's give the axe. I don't know why the harmonica went off. <clears throat> We chopped down as many trees as we could. It wasn't much, but hopefully it will make the difference. Hungry? Fatigued. No one's going out. Sometimes a sudden urge to play an instrument takes over us to create beautiful sounds to be shared with the world around us, to sing and play and have cute mutated animals come to our feet to listen. Like a post-apocalyptic Snow White, shall we? Okay, I guess. I don't think we wanted rodents in the house, though. I don't want mutated animals in the house. Oh, great, we got cockroaches. We should not have done that. Careful what you wish for. Now we've got cockroaches everywhere. Nice. Thirsty? Thirsty? We are not going out. Uh, funky roaches haven't really left us. To be fair, they aren't causing that much trouble. They been say, seem relatively friendly and curious. Just this morning, when we opened our eyes, we saw them standing in a perfect line right in front of us, as if they were waiting for something. All right. Yeah. Oh, Disco Roach? Wow. I got an achievement for Disco Roach. The roaches are gone. Well, that was okay. Oh, wow, we got one food, one water. If you can't beat them, join them. We figured the roaches are craving more of our music, so we filled their unspoken request, they started joyfully prancing around again, creating the fun shapes on the floor. Then all of a sudden, they all left in one line. We thought the snow was over, but they soon came back in a group carrying supplies, their strong mutated backs. Insane. Looks like we made some new friends, disgusting mutated radioactive friends. Nice. Well, we have loads of food and water here. This is crazy. Are we going to get rescued any day soon? Mysterious sounds are coming from our radio. But they're hidden behind a ton of static. Do we want to tinker with it a bit and find the right frequency? It could be something important or it could be the opposite. Eh, okay. I think we're gonna break the radio though. Mm -hmm. 
radio is not broken. We managed to get a slightly clear signal after twisting some knobs and pressing some buttons. A female voice talked about being stranded in space. Oh, it's a space one. Well, it's better than listening to nothing about it. Hungry, you get to eat. No one's going out. Um, a knock on the door is not something we take lightly these days. So, when a man came to our doorstep today offering a highly profitable game of cards, we weren't convinced. Is a bed of two soup cans in reasonable choice? Well, yeah, why not? As long as we don't lose the cards. We don't need the food, but whatever. We lose soup, we gain soup, who knows. It looks like we won. We did win. Thirsty, you get to drink. Thirsty, you get to drink. No one's going out. It seems whoever it was, they met their end after a series of terrifying screams. The radio fell silent. Just before that, a distressed woman recited her full name and address. She used to live in our town. Should we take a, take a hike to her house and find out if she left anything of value? It's not like she will need anything. At least that's what it sounded like. No. We're not going to steal from her. She might be still alive. Ah, uh, this is just dangerous. It's not probably a trap or anything. I'd, I, yeah, I'd, I wouldn't do it. I wouldn't do it. Fatigued, hungry, you get to eat. No one's going out. When attempting our bucket in front of the shelter, we discovered a hastily drawn map on the ruined wall. Someone drew it. A route marked a spot. The end of it. Maybe there are supplies hidden there. Should we check it out? I'm tempted to say no, but then I don't know. Maybe we can end the game by saying yes. Alright, she's alive. Oh, we got a padlock. Nice. Okay, well, we haven't been raided once on this run, so. The woman on the radio has been silent, but the transmission didn't stop completely. We have been hearing weird beeps and whispers coming from the speakers, as well as something sounding faintly like a harmonica. Who or what is transmitting this? It sounds un otherworldly. Are they trying to play music? Should we respond? Would they even listen? Respond, yeah, why not? <coughs> oh god, achievement not alone. Oh my goodness. What is this? We're okay to go. We're okay to go. We grabbed the mouth organ and headed outside when the transmission started again. We looked up at the radioactive night sky and played a sorrowful blues tune. We were about to give up, but then we saw lights flashing overhead. Far between the stars, the colorful lights pulsed and flashed. They were listening, and they heard us. We don't know if it's humans or something extraterrestrial. But of one thing we have no doubt, we are not alone. We wrote down the sequence of the lights pulsing just in case, but it probably doesn't mean anything. Okay. Alright. Thirsty hungry? Thirsty. What we initially thought was thunder turned out to be heavy knocking on the door. Someone either hates that door or is very determined to have someone answer it. Should we open the door? Oh, I don't know. It could be... I don't know, it could be the military. We have a gun. A new hope. The end. Did we win? Oh, we got rescued! Let's go! We were ecstatic when, when our friends came over today to officially invite us into their new camp. The siblings said they are incredibly grateful for all the help and assistance we've provided. They claimed the whole thing wouldn't have been possible without us. They swear already made a separate house for us, all furnished with all our own supplies. And there are plenty of families awaiting to meet us. We can't wait to be between the family again. Maybe the world isn't as bad as it looks. We can't wait to start our new, more peaceful, normal life. Goodbye, little shelter. You have been our home for a long time, but today it's time to move on and the future is looking really bright. We did it, guys. Let's go! Day 60. We won. Third game, we won. <coughs> we survived.
That was a long one. That looks bad. Time to defend the show. We never got raided once. Yeah, they did survive. They did. Let's have a look at the achievements. Wait, it's from Wyvern? Oh, it's so trippy in the eyes. Right. Achievements. Extraterrestrial achievement. Yeah, this looks great. 40 days. Where's my 60 day achievement? Jesus. Alright guys, well I hope you enjoyed that. I'll see you guys next time on the next episode. Do you girls want to say goodbye to you guys? Bye! You want to say leave a like and subscribe button if you want to see more of this. Let me know in the comments below. See you guys next time.